Good morning, guys, from Big Springs, Nebraska. It's 43 degrees this morning. Cold as hell. I don't like cold. We finally got the truck out the shop from the oil change. I mean, the oil the whatever we had done. They had it, they screwed it all up. That's going to be a whole other video where I'm beating up on Rush Truck Centers. So we won't talk about it right now. Really, right? So we're on our way to Minneapolis, as you know. If it's 43 here, what the hell is it in Minneapolis? If I get, if I get time there, I'm going to unload the bikes on. Take a ride. Take a little trip. Take a little trip. This thing here just, I don't like it. There, I got it tightened up a little bit. There's going to be snow flying out here before long. I had to wake the girl up. She's really chipper this morning. She slept for eight hours. Little dog had a bad seizure earlier and he stopped breathing. Don't worry. I gave him mouth to snout and he's back again. So we're taking him back into the vet and I guess I'm going to have to get him on some kind of medication. I, I can't have him stop and breathe. I love that dog. He's my buddy. Take a little drink and take a little drink. Go daddy go. Woohoo. All right, fellas, I'm sorry I let y'all down. I didn't get no driving footage hardly because it was nighttime and I was in bed. She motored up here all by herself, and got us real close, but we still can't unload today. Right, we should have known that yesterday and then I wouldn't have had to get up at three o'clock in the morning and drove. Right, we could have slept. That would have been- How come you didn't call him yesterday? Wait a minute, I'm not the phone call guy. He claims he managed fine before I came along, but now he can't make a phone call without me. You Just admit that you need me. I do. But you make your phone calls before you start your trip. That's nobody the, was talking to you. I'm just telling you that's how you do it. I said nobody was talking to you. All right, all right. I see how you are. Well, yeah, you, 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 you're kind of going the wrong direection. Why are you way over there for? Well, because I don't know. This guy was out in front of us. He ain't bothering you. Leave that guy alone. They, they took the strip bar out here. We were at uh, the Stockman's truck stop over here in Minneapolis. There used to be a strip bar here 26 years ago. Uh, Admiral Marches was upstairs here. It was the first company I was leased on to. Admiral Marches is a good company. You all got a drop deck or step deck. Come on over, Matt. Admiral Marches. I like them. You don't let the dog run you out of your seat. Do you realize that you let him run you out of the seat? You let him lead you, you when y'all go out walking? You, do you realize that these dogs rule the truck whether we want them to or not? Yeah, but when it comes to your seat, you gotta, you know. Last night, the little dog had a seizure. I'm in the back asleep, and the first thing I do is, is look for him. I feel two of the dogs, can't find the other one. With the cover off of me, come running up front. I had him. He, I know he was having a seizure though. I heard his little cries and y'all know he rides in my lap. In charge. And he moved around and and uh, got all stiff. And I knew what was happening. I was listening to the YouTube, and I was going seventy. I had a hard. I had to get it off the road, right? And and do CPR and stuff. Thank God the girl was there. Jesus, the, take the wheel. That's the first time he's ever quit breathing. When he's had a seizure. Normally he has them and he's just tired all day and stuff. He's never quit breathing before. Daddy gave him mouth to snout and brought him back though. We're so proud of you. Oh, uh, it's... I got experience from the icky days. My old dog used to die all the time. And I have to resuscitate him. Until I couldn't resuscitate him no more. But we're going we're gonna to get him on some medicine. I, I can't have that happening. It would be depressing. He used to have seizures all the time. He don't have them much anymore, but that was the worst one he's ever had. He don't have them hardly at all now, but the ones he has is like worse. Worse. Yeah, that's true. I don't know what that means, but I don't know. Uh, we're go we can't deliver this load tonight. We'll have to deliver it in the morning, and we'll take the other half to Atlanta. 
We'll talk to you. Double biller. Yeah, double biller. It was going to be a triple biller. They had a they had another one but we couldn't in route for us to pick up and take to Miami. We were going to get rid of this engine. You know, another another, another forty five hundred dollars. But uh, I got to go home, so I had to tell them no, nope, no. Nope, for nope. seven hundred miles. Yeah. Damn it. Triple, triple. <sighs> Little dog's worth it. I don't care what it costs. Give it up. And since the Rush Truck Centers didn't fix our leak, our oil leak. Did you tell them about? I told them that will be a whole separate video I'm going to do downgrading. Have you been having entire conversations with these people without me? Yes. That I'm going to downgrade Rush Truck Centers in a video. I don't like to be negative, but a review is a review. And we've been to four Rush Truck Centers in the last two years, and they've all put the the screws to us. And I don't like that. I don't. I just a business. We're in charge. That's just well, well, plain and simple. And with a Max Force engine, sometimes people don't work on it because it's a Max Force. I wish so you would move the, that dog and scoot over. So that's the only <clears throat> option is to go to the stupid Rush Truck Center. There, is it's, that better? Yes. Don't let him bully you. He's just going to get hair all over me now. He's going to do that anyway. He's a hairy dog. I hope you're happy. Yes, much better. I like you centered. Whatever. Yeah. I like you with a finger in your eye. Oh, you're so fine. We're going to go in here and eat. She'll be nicer after she eats. She ain't had no sleep yet since uh, I, since I got her up this morning. So I'm going to feed her up. and I'm not going to let her go right to bed, though, because we're going to finish Sons of Anarchy. Y'all so behind. Y'all know what happened. And since the only, th only, only episode I ever saw was the last 15 minutes of the very last episode I know what's going to happen it's a Greek tragedy but oh well she don't know so we can't talk about it but after it's over we're almost done anyway do we got one more season or well, is this the last season one season one season and one one episode I think we're going to finish it tonight I might get her reaction or I might not she I might, might jab him in the eye. Oh, that's not the right reaction. We'll talk to you guys later. We gotta get some food. Bye. Bye. Is that like Komichiwa? I don't know what that means. Komichiwa? That sounds like a pornography word. It's it's Japanese. For what? Hello and goodbye. You got the same word? Yes. Come on. Is Ola hello and goodbye too? Ola? It's hello. I don't know if it's goodbye. Biles Candias. Get the freak out of here. I don't know. See you guys later.